On this episode of Tools in Action, we are going to talk about the Ryobi 12 and a half inch planer. All right, guys, this planer is more than plain. It has exact depth control. It has a 15 amp motor, which is going to give you smoother cuts. And it also has a four column frame, which is going to reduce snipe and it has an improved finish. And the greatest thing about it is that it's Ryobi green. All right, guys, today we're talking about the Ryobi, Ryobi, however you like to call it, planer. Ryobi is known as a homeowner brand. It is available at the Home Depot. And uh, honestly, I like this planer. I like the size of it. I like the, how easy it is to carry from the top. And it's just simplicity, you know? It just seems to work and do the job, grip the wood. But I'm gonna throw it over to Eric, who is the plain planer man. That's your new name, the plain planer I don't plane man. a ton of stuff, but doing the house, I have done certain stuff because what's it? Uh, there's a wood store over by us that gets all sorts oh, reclaimed of wood. reclaimed wood and all that. So I, I do use a planer a lot. Before this one, I was using the Dewalt. Now, I'm a fan of Ryobi. I like Ryobi, but I also understand that it's a homeowner brand. So when I saw this, I wasn't expecting a ton, but it's this actually surprised the heck out of me. For $329, uh, this is a this is a good good homeowner Do you planer. have a planer currently? I do. I have the Dewalt. Now, the Dewalt's $300 more. Now, that oh, has... It's like double? It's double. Oh, my God. That has three knives as opposed to two knives on here. Um, I, would admit, I don't know what amp motor that has. Um... <laughs> But with the DeWalt, again, it's nice and it's got more features than this does. I like the but, feature list on this. It's just easy. Well, no, because the DeWalt's got a nice feature where you can't go, go below. Like, hey, if I want to go an inch and a quarter, I can set it on the side, inch and a quarter. No matter how far I drop this, it will stop at an inch and a quarter. So I know precisely. Right. That's one nice thing. But, you know, a couple nice things about this one is it's got the stainless, it looks like stainless steel bars on the side. It, glides up and down really nicely on them and it also has a kind of like the screw it's a metal screw on here and not plastic which i like that's huge to screw it up and down up wait and have you seen plastic up. ones no but oh. certain companies do try to you know cheap things out and i think with this one the way that they did with the frame this is a nice nice system nice setup and the one thing i noticed is we ran a lot of different wood through here it pulls the wood through where I've had on other planters where you gotta kind of push more, it doesn't always pull it through, um, which is kind of a pain. So that's when you get the sniping and stuff like that, you don't have it with this. And I don't know if I already said, but this has two knives on there, which is easy to access on the back and, and simple to change the blades if you need to. Cool. So, what you know means? what those are? No. Yeah, I don't either. Later. All right, so on the back of here, you have your tools. This will actually open up so you can get to your two knives back there. Then it comes with two magnets to actually lift the knives out. So, stored right in the back, which is nice. It's a cool planer, you guys. I don't see a problem with it. I mean, honestly, if I'm in a store, I mean, how often do you use a planer? Yeah, if you're using it every day, you might want to look at a professional planer. If you're that homeowner, you know, that DIY type that maybe uses it once a couple times a week, this is one to be perfect. I think even for the pros, we see a lot of pros who have Ryobi and stuff like that. Ryobi sanders, like the yeah, circular all sorts sander of thing. Things. And if you're a guy, like, and you're doing you trim work, stuff like this, but like, ah, you know, I do it maybe like, like you're saying, you know, maybe a couple times a month or whatever. I think this is a great one to own. You yeah, know. Ryobi, Ryobi, it's killing it lately, you guys. Check them out at Home Depot. It uh, the HP series, just definitely they're dude, they're so much better than they used to be. Oh, they're nine, nine. But I mean, think about it. If you think back to when they were the different color, I mean, they were still good back then. I mean, I remember we were doing construction in a commercial building, and that's what we had was the old blue. It was blue and yellow Ryobis, and I could not believe because I remember when we brought them like this was homeowner stuff. You know what I mean? But I honestly couldn't believe how long it lasted. And I mean, we would drop those things and, and, and they worked. They were great yeah. tools. And they're just, you know, good stuff. Peace. Remember, for more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.